Okay, I'm gonna play Pokemon Platinum. Why? I don't know what else to do, and I honestly am very bored, and I need video content, and nothing else is really, really working for me right now. So, we're just gonna stick with Pokemon Platinum. No question how I'm playing this. No one can. It's every, it's every YouTube that's deeply changed question. This is obviously a Technically, the one I can bring up, I have like, evil and diamonds. Like, I do have that, like, natural version of the whole thing. Like, the process. Platinum, on the other hand, I don't, I never got that game. Same thing with black and white, too. And white. I never actually played Pokemon Black. I just played Pokemon White. And then Pokemon Black, too. And Pokemon White, too. So, yeah, it's complete, completely paid for, paid like 40 bucks for this, this is completely, yeah. So, Pokemon Platinum, if you didn't know, the actual name of the character, which, keep in mind, never can in names, I don't know why, no one uses them, they're supposed to be blank slate characters, but the standard name is Lucas, not Ness, Lucas, I'm um, I'm not even sure if you watch his videos. No, His name is Barry, but I don't constantly name him boy. And then Nolan and Gavin just want to tell him names. Nolan, you know, with Gavin, I've had a plan. I've got a plan. I know I'm not so good. But, yeah. Still don't sound like a name to be a game character. Now go on, leap into the world of Pokemon. I am not going to narrate everything that happens because that, that would just be difficult. So if I've learned anything from playing Pokemon Platinum, it how many freaky times I I tried to do stuff like an idiot as an idiot child. For whatever reason, I had this dumb thing where I couldn't I couldn't get past the first part without like getting called to do something. So then I closed the game. The game would I, I would turn it all the way off because I'm an idiot. I keep forgetting it and just close the, the lid. And, yeah. So now every single time I start the Gen 4 games, I save first frame, because I always get interrupted in this part, and I really hope that this time one song is not going to happen now, but this Barry being barges into your house, says, wow, you have a new computer, we're going to go see the professor who steals Pokemon, and if you're late to dual bank robbery, I'm fighting you, because you're going to pay me the money now, got it, buddy? And then he runs off. Yep, that's all you need to know. This is Pokemon. Oh, and then Mom. He was in a hurry. Yeah, he's trying to rob a bank, Mom. I'm pretty, pretty sure we should probably stop him. You know what? Nah. Don't go into the tall grass. Why Pokemon might be attack you? Also, what the heck? Why do they only appear in the tall grass? Is it because they can hide there? And if so, then why not appear in the trees? No way they do. Not in this game, but they did, they did that to me. Ah yes, thud. Make it entire the whole text box and put two exclamation to after to make sure that you know it's happening. I'm going to see a professor. We're going to rob him. You should come too. Oh jeez, I forgot my bag to put the stolen stolen goods in. I need to go back. Is that where he's going back from? Is he easy? Better take my bag and turn Oh, yeah, I caught it. God, not that I haven't played this game before, but I was like, oh, this is bad. This is bad. Yeah. Also, what's up with him consistently saying, I'm gonna find you $10 million? I'm probably just gonna make a video up to the point where, you know, I pick my Pokemon because I really don't want to go to a rich gym. That's just a lot to do. Too slow. Oh, too slow? Okay, let's fix that. 
that completely over again. Trust me. Scoot over to the next patch before anyone can get you. Hold it. What is the meaning of doing stupidity? Haven't your parents taught you anything? You don't go into the fucking dog grass, you idiot with a poke. The world would surely change if you need a poke. Also, let me put this in disrespect to you guys. This person sees two reckless kids who are about to essentially endanger themselves. So, he says, I'm going to give them the very thing that will let them get into more danger. So that way they can do stupider. And he even acknowledges this very fact. But then he still gives us Pokemon, because it's clearly a Pokemon game. You can't really have a Pokemon game without Pokemon, you can you? They never do the whole, you can catch your own first Pokemon thing, now it's giving us some start. It'd be kinda cool if you could catch your first Pokemon, but I understand the idea why like, you can't you need to end up having to do what they call me, but instead you're a warning. Really, I forgot. I was like, confused about why it started like this. I forgot. I played Binding first, so I, I blind, 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 I might have Binding for this Essentially, okay. As soon as you get your first Pokemon, your Diamond, you go over to the lake and actually take them against this whale. Just like he doesn't know you're taking his Pokemon, then you use them and they want to stay with you. But in the Platinum version, he actually gives you Pokemon. So one time, he, you steal his stuff, and then he gives you something for it. And this time, you try to put yourself in mortal danger, and he gives you something for it. Open the poke bo the box. It's four balls. Oh, what each one? Choose one. Uh... Clip-Hop was my first run in Diamond. Turn to a guy hate, so it chipped out. That's my logic. I've already done pip up. I hate Turtwig, I just don't like his design, I don't like his evolution design, and I hate their moveset, so I'm choosing Jimchar. Not because I actually like Jimchar, but simply because I just prefer Pip-Up's design. Like, I don't like Empoleon, but I do really like pip up And I don't really like Infernape, but I do like Monferno. So, I mean, third evolution don't really the best in this gen, in my opinion. Remember, it's an opinion you're allowed to disagree with me, just not give me death threats. I love how when you ever get to do something on the internet, you have to go, don't give me death threats about it, because for having an opinion, because al I'm allowed to have an opinion that's inherently wrong, because. <laughs> the time has finally come, I challenge you. Also, we went from being ready to challenge Pokemon to Pokemon battling. But the thing I don't understand is that wouldn't it make more sense for you both to train your Pokemon than go and So some some psychotic man decided that he was going to do a, a no-hit run. You can do that, but you have to manipulate AI, which is Pippa will always start out with Growl. She will use Growl if you use Beer. Meaning, you have to... Like, it's a specific way to manipulate the AI when you use Leer a set amount of times before she attacks, so that way she won't attack you. And you can manipulate it into doing this fight without getting hit. From that point on, you're just grinding and then soft setting. You have Pokemon attacks you and hoping that the Pokemon never uses the move. You get ridiculously overleveled, and then, yeah. Really, I'm not doing it over here, Prime, because I'm just not going to. But essentially, I think Pipwop wants to consistently be stronger than you, and so she'll use two brows every single time you use one here. Yeah, that's what she's doing. And that's how you manipulate it, and you just have to hit her 19 times, or whatever the amount of times your health is, but she thought it's just like, I could have used Lear again. The other turn and then hit him and wish you all to win. 
that's the way how to manipulate the AI. But I'm not going to do that because I simply just don't give you Whether or not she can make a comeback is beyond me. We should able to technically take two hits. But, but anyway. But yeah, it is possible to manipulate the starter Pokemon's AI in order to be I really hate that you can do it, but it is a thing. See how it is. Speed up. I, I don't care what you have to say, Bob. Yep, this is this is why we're really doing this for the first minute. This whole cutscene of just you getting the Pokemon requires you to go. Because they shove all this stuff on you at the beginning. And I really don't understand. I'm surprised there's never been a person who's made a remark if they could be a parent that just says, I don't see a button on these shoes, though. I wonder what they're talking about. Yeah, so, this is like, the whole first part of the story. Or at the lake, you get your Pokemon. I forgot, this is Platinum, so technically I gotta do this part too. You gotta be flowing town. The expanding space. I think Cyrus. This is allow you to get out of my way. Yeah, I don't know why 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 I don't Okay, I can eat all The first one to progress the ropes down rules. Yeah, let's just get this whole beginning part done. Hopefully. Ah, yes. Okay. Yep. This is how this goes. Uh, dude. Uh, Oh, we're out of here. Technically, we're going to sleep in the middle of And this is why I feel like the game must take a huge, a huge, a huge, a huge pain for that person to ever get to a new run. I mean, it's definitely possible to you get to level 100 that you get to sleep in the middle, which you can do. By, uh, RNG. Uh, you can, uh, move through the game without getting hit because you can just simply the problem is there's a lot of blood Pokemon that say I just says first turn attack I just I don't know you'd have to like understand the AI to get but then again case in point this turn who isn't going to attack by the way the same way I want to say he isn't going to attack me but then he uses his attack Sometimes you just get that. And then we lose it. We learn Ember. And if you stab is a huge buff to the beginning of the game. So getting that Ember of level 7, giving, being given level 6, really good, honestly. Huge buff. Because now Growl doesn't work. And then, so that's the thing I realized. In this generation, we start out with this Absorb Not Lion Whip. See, every Pokemon starts out with a special move, which causes you to get a huge power buff at the beginning of the game. I think Vine Whip was, like, a weird move, though, because, you know, the first grass starter... No, we're just gonna keep on the same. I could never think of a good name for Dumbjar. I'll do it later, but you can name the comments, because I checked the comments. My name is Rome. 
Actually, what is this? Rowan? Rowan? Also, whatever you like how he says, you don't want to do what I'm asking you to do? Uh, I'll sit here for hours waiting for you until you say yes. Also, they act as if you could choose the same Pokemon as one. And this. Okay, TM for short, whoever at TM is going to lose return. So, first thing I gotta say, I do have ideal teams for this game. And essentially, yeah, I'm going to go and get it because I'm me. Pokemon games, you know how this goes. Sa saving your game data? Well, I guess if you like the video, like and subscribe. You know, the use, it, it is what it is. And yeah, that's just. That, that's all I gotta say. It's please. Please like the video, leave a comment, or do something, any interaction is good at this point.